Andy Mulholland with Remax of Rochester and the Handy Andy Realtor team. And today I'm pleased to bring you a 5,400 square foot Queen Anne Victorian style home. This home, known as the Perry House, is located in the heart of Zimbroda, Minnesota. It sits on just over one acre and was originally built in 1896. Follow us around as we give you a tour of this very unique home. So just off the grand foyer is the grand parlor. Now both of these rooms feature quarter sawn oak woodwork with dental molding all in excellent condition as well as pocket doors that still function perfectly. Well here we are in the massive dining room that this home has to offer and again you'll notice original woodwork, period specific light fixtures and wallpaper and I'm going to take this opportunity to point out the fact that most of the windows in the home have been updated with a modern energy efficient window. Now this room is located just off of the kitchen and dining space. It may have originally been a maid's quarters of some kind, but is now set up as more of an informal living space. Perfect for grabbing a TV show or reading your favorite magazine. The kitchen of the home. This features a large center island with butcher block countertops. We've got a uh, dishwasher, stove, and microwave here for modern convenience, as well as a lot of storage in these cabinets. But these cabinets are not original to the home, but do offer a lot of great storage. Originally, this room would not have had any cabinets, and there is a room off to the side here that does feature the original cabinets to the home. Now the second level is a long hallway that opens up to five different bedrooms and a laundry room, as well as this full bath that has been completely renovated, with slipper tub, custom walk-in shower, and subway tile. Come take a closer look. So one of the first things that we notice when we walk in the full bath is this slipper clawfoot tub. Now most clawfoot tubs are flat where this one has the elevated back, which is why they refer to it as a slipper tub. And also, as you notice, you've got the custom subway tile on the wall and the custom tile floor, as well as directly behind you, there is a walk-in shower with custom tile and glass doorway. So each of the five bedrooms on the second level has original woodwork and flooring, as well as period-specific lighting and leaded glass windows. You'll also notice in this bedroom, the, the look of wallpaper on the walls, it's actually custom done stenciling that is meant to look like Victorian wallpaper. Now the massive third level would not have originally been finished with the home, but the sellers have had it finished and made quite a living space. Up here we have a full bathroom with jacuzzi tub. We've got an, an extra living space to the left. On the right we have an open area that has plumbing that could be used as a kitchen and then behind me, a bedroom with walk-in closet. Now, a couple things about this level, being that it was never originally finished, it didn't have custom woodwork up here. So rather than put in you know, a cheaper woodwork, the sellers went into a home of the same era that was set to be torn down and refurbished all the woodwork. They also got the flooring, which is one foot pine flooring, and had that uh, removed from a Sears warehouse and put in to the floors up here. So a lot of unique features and just a great place to hang out. Now, not only did the sellers take the time and money to have period specific light fixtures installed, but they've also had a professional wallpaper come in and put period specific wallpaper on the ceilings as well. And actually that's four layers of wallpaper that you see. This, as you can see, is an original beautiful parquet flooring. The sellers found this parquet flooring under about three layers of linoleum and it is completely original to the house in excellent condition. Well, that concludes our tour of 182 Knight Street East. This is only the third time this home has been offered for sale since 1896. So please contact us if you have any questions. We'd be happy to show it to you in person.